what's going on everyone? Joe's from Anovia Wheels and I'm here with Sam. And we are looking at the Anovia Titan today, one of our wheels from the Deco Directional lineup and really kind of considered one of the underdogs of our wheel lineup, it's right? a little bit of the underdog. Like Elder's kind of the top seller, but this yeah. one, it's coming up to the ranks. Yeah. A lot of cool builds. It kind of on. puts the Elder, you know, like neck and neck, really, when it comes down yeah. to stuff. It looks good on a lot of different platforms. So we're going to take a look into this today, talk about some different weights, talk about different sizes, what it looks good on. Finishes. And of course, yeah, what it makes the Titan what it is yeah. and, you know, what we see it the most on. So. Before we go ahead and get in, if you're looking for a new set of wheels, don't forget to check out Anovia Wheels over at anoviawheels.com. You can check them out, you can pair them with some tires, you can get them mount balance and ship for free, so you don't have to worry about going to a tire shop and dealing with all of that. We'll even stretch them for you. It's a good time. Saves a lot of fast. Saves a lot of time, money, and a headache. So. Yeah. so one thing that really is unique about the Titan, I guess really about all of our wheels in specific, is that we use um, specific molds for each size. Yeah. So we want to maximize the concavity as much as we could. Kind of talked about with the Elder review that we did last Last week that we had, you know, five and a half inches of concavity and then 19 by 11, we use the same technique over to bring into the Titan as well. So with each size, each width, each offset, you get the most concavity out of as well. So when you get up to like 18 by 10 and a half plus 22, um, you get a ton of concavity, which is really what sets these wheels apart and what a lot of people are looking to go with. They either want like a big lip or they want it concave, or and they either want a big lip or they want a concave. And with all those molds too, it's crazy because it's not just a oh, one mold per size. We have left and right side sets. Yes. So it's double the molds, <laughs> double the fun. Yeah. Yeah. We made it really hard on ourselves but to make sure that you know you guys get a really good looking wheel that fits what you need it to and of course clears big brakes with all that concavity so we're talking about sizes for the titan of course we're talking about 18 inch options as of right now so going from your 18 by eight and a half up to 18 by 10 and a half so this right here is 18 by nine and a half plus 15 it's one of the more aggressive sizes yep. uh, we see these a lot going on things like uh, your genesis's your um, evos things like that people that are running more of an aggressive setup uh, wrx's too if they have like a bit of like a more wide body look to them yep. um, really kind of that plus 15 fits a lot of uh, different things even uh, when you're looking at like some s chassis and things like that that need a you little more aggressive it, offsets maximize that concavity too. exactly it makes it look really really good uh, we are going to be expanding this uh, in the near future here in 2022 moving into 17s and 19s to kind of hit uh, both ends of the spectrum a little bit more some guys that want the 17s a little lighter weight wheel a little more clearance especially for like the performance side of things yep. and then 19s for more like the show guys that want to throw them on like 370s g37s genesis coupes all that sort of stuff that we're going to be expanding those sizes into and also still be lightweight Same yeah principles you applied before exactly we currently offer the titan in two finishes this is the brush apollo silver and the other finish we have is the raven black kind of more of that stealth look with yeah. it um honestly in this sizing with the raven black it's a really aggressive looking wheel mm -hmm. kind of when you see you see it and with the, the way the spokes a little thinner it looks really cool with the big brake setup so this thing will clear of course absolutely so i know the brush silver is like one by far one of our most popular finishes you get like the brush face and the rest of it's painted yep. it's a really uh unique kind of contrast to it and then of course the whole thing is cleared uh, to make sure that you know nothing's gonna affect that brush surface or anything like that but i love the brush silver we're also gonna be expanding this this year as well we are going to offer it in white and that's actually yeah. from you guys yeah we, we literally asked, asked. <laughs> yeah the community we did a poll and everything and overwhelmingly everyone said white so we're gonna do it this year yeah so a gloss white be coming in 2022 need a cool name for it yet but it is coming really soon so the titan is our lightest wheel that we offer right now coming in lightest uh more than the elder than the knight the carrier yep. uh we're coming on in around 17.9 pounds starting Super off so uh, yeah so we're an 18 by eight and a half 17.9 pounds and then getting really only up to about like 18.9 19 pounds for the 18 by 10 yep. and a half so, like I said, lightest wheel that we currently offer in that thanks, of course, to the Artform technology, the rotary forging process that we use to make all of our wheels. Uh, you get a super thin barrel that's forged. It's got a really good strength to it. It meets JWL VIA standards. Yeah. Uh, can, goes through all the load rating testings, everything like that. So we're not sacrificing any like strength or quality with it by making it lightweight. But we're also doing a lot of stuff on the backside here. So you can see on the back of the spokes with the the spoke backpack shaving, milling. the back pad milling, and of course the pocketing around the hub as well. You'll see that on pretty much every Anovia yeah. wheel that we'll do, that we want to save as much weight as possible, and that's a great way to do it. So the Titan, of course, also clears the biggest of brakes. We designed this specifically for clearing Evo's STI brakes, because yeah. honestly, this wheel's kind of designed to look really good on those platforms, and it does, along with Evo, WRX, STI, also looks good on the FRS, mm -hmm. BRZ, 10th Gen Civic, and the Arlen's out front looks absolutely <laughs> sick with his Titans on there. Yeah, 
Uh, we did some specific uh, fitments as this as well, like the 18 by 9.5 plus 38, uh, the 5x100 for like your BRZs and stuff like that. But the Evo was the one that we really wanted to hit with this wheel as well, because like a lot of those guys run into issues like with the factory Brembo's and stuff, like the Evo 8s, Evo 9s, they come with those factory Brembo's. Like they're, they're some pretty <laughs> big boys. And a lot of, unfortunately, a lot of aftermarket wheels, you know, run into issues or have to run like a three mil spacer or something yeah. just to clear the brakes, which in then turn affects like the actual overall fitment of the car, which they don't want to deal with. So what we did is, uh, okay, we're just gonna clear the biggest brakes possible. Right yeah, and we just made sure that with the amount of concavity, the way the spokes come out, that we're gonna clear those brakes for the Evo. So if you're interested in finding out more about the Anovia Titan or just wanna see it on some cars and see, you know, what, yeah. what it would cost to pair it with some tires and get it sent to your door, you know, in a matter of like a week or so, That's you can go right. check it out at anoviawheels.com. You can go check out the gallery, you can sort by the Titan, you can check out the other models that we have available. And of course, keep an eye on our socials like Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, all the stuff. We're gonna be posting updates there all the time. So when those new sizes are about to drop or those new finishes are coming out, or if you want to put some input into like what new finishes or sizes Absolutely. we should do, you know, we take that or we take that feedback into strong consideration. We really ask you guys what you want to see. So in the meantime, go check out anoviawheels.com and don't forget to subscribe and check out all of our other socials. I'm Gels. I'm Sam. We'll see you later.